Total Audio Converter converts music in three steps. After you've selected the files and the target format, the wizard will open. First, it asks you where it should place the output files. You can select an existing folder on your computer or create a new one. Total Audio Converter can also add the converted files to your iTunes. Just tick the checkbox. With Total Audio Converter, you can combine several tracks into one. Next, you select the sample rate. The higher sample rate you set, the better quality you get, but the file size increases. I advise you to select between 24 kilohertz and 44 kilohertz. Next comes the channels tab. If you convert music, you choose stereo. Mono is used if you want to reduce the size as much as possible and the output quality is not very important. Bitrate refers to quality too. The higher, the better. 128 kilobytes per second and up is usually okay. The last step summarizes your settings. Check the Add to iTunes Library option if you want and press Start. The files are being converted. After the conversion's over, Total Audio Converter shows you the details, how many files were processed successfully, and if there are any warnings or errors. Total Audio Converter. It's not a pain to convert.